In a move that has sent shockwaves through the electric vehicle industry and beyond, Elon Musk may have just sounded the death knell for the lithium-ion battery. With three simple, yet paradigm-shifting words, end of lithium, Musk effectively declared war on the entire battery supply chain as we know it. This isn't hyperbole or marketing fluff. It's the bold assertion of a company poised to unveil what could be the most disruptive battery technology in a century. The Illum battery, poised for release in the upcoming 2026 Tesla Model 2, this new technology could render all previous electric vehicles, even Tesla's own previous models, obsolete and destined for museums. While the world fixated on the familiar range anxiety, charging stations, battery degradation, and skyrocketing lithium prices, Musk and Tesla were quietly building a future where none of those concerns matter anymore. The aluminum ion battery, long considered a promising but elusive alternative, is finally being brought into mass market reality, and not just as a theoretical experiment, but as a manufacturable, affordable solution that could bring electric mobility to every income level. Elon Musk's warning about electricity generation challenges in the coming year wasn't just about infrastructure, it was a veiled recognition of lithium's own physical and economic limitations. As lithium prices soared and supply chains frayed under demand pressure, Tesla has been preparing for this exact moment. Their answer, a battery that doesn't rely on scarce materials, doesn't cost a fortune, and can be produced with higher efficiency and greater performance. The aluminum ion battery. It's not science fiction. It's not a prototype locked in a lab. It's a near future reality, and it might cost as little as $1,795 per pack. That's a staggering figure when you consider that current lithium ion battery packs can easily exceed $10,000 in total costs depending on size and configuration. But how could Tesla create a battery so advanced, so efficient, and so cheap, all at once? The answer lies in Tesla's unmatched mastery of vertical integration, innovative manufacturing techniques, and their audacious long-term vision. The company has been quietly developing a proprietary process, known internally as air cell fusion, in partnership with the University of Texas, while competitors fought over lithium rights in hostile terrains and deserts. Tesla looked to aluminum, the third most abundant element in the Earth's crust, Unlike lithium, aluminum doesn't require rare earth mining, complex extraction processes, or geopolitical maneuvering. It costs roughly $2,000 per ton compared to lithium's expected $15,000 per ton in 2025. That's a 7 to 12 times material, cost advantage before manufacturing even begins. And that's just the beginning. Tesla's foresight was on full display in 2019 when it acquired Maxwell Technologies. At the time, many dismissed the deal as another splashy but vague acquisition. In reality, it gave Tesla the drug technology that is now critical to aluminum ion cell production. Traditional lithium ion batteries rely on a wet paste coating process that's energy intensive and environmentally damaging. Tesla's dry process reduces energy consumption by up to 70% and slashes the required factory space by half. Their pilot facility, the Cato Road facility in California, has been fine tuning this manufacturing approach with astounding results. Combined with aluminum's cost effectiveness and material abundance, the total production cost for these new batteries is being reduced to levels that make lithium-based competitors look antiquated and expensive. Tesla's vertical integration isn't just a buzzword. It's the key weapon that separates them from legacy automakers. While companies like Ford and GM are still at the mercy of third-party battery suppliers such as CATL or LG, often paying steep premiums and facing endless logistical issues, Tesla controls everything from the raw materials to final battery assembly. Their global gigafactory network, Fremont, Shanghai, Berlin, Texas, and the new facility in Mexico offers a production scale unmatched by any other automaker on Earth. With this infrastructure, aluminum ion batteries can piggyback on existing logistics, staff, and facilities, achieving 30% lower costs than lithium ion packs. By 2026, Tesla's factories in Shanghai and Texas are expected to produce massive quantities of 4,680 cells, and aluminum ion versions will roll off the same lines accelerating scalability and reducing risk. Skeptics may question whether a $1,795 BATTERY pack is possible, but the cost breakdown tells a compelling story. Roughly $1,000 of that figure accounts for raw materials and production. Another $500 goes toward amortizing R&D investment. The remaining $295 is Tesla's profit. Given the company's historical ability to disrupt markets, including a 20% price reduction on the Model 3 since 2017, this target is not only believable, it's likely. We're talking about battery packs offering $30 per kilowatt tower, down from the current industry average of $100 to $150 per kWh for lithium-based solutions. That's not just evolution, it's battery industry obliteration. Aluminum ion cells also offer rapid charge times, enhanced safety, and extended cycle lives. 
but what truly terrifies Tesla's competitors is the scalability of this tech. Aluminum is globally abundant, doesn't require dangerous or polluting mining methods, and integrates perfectly with Tesla's existing vehicle structures, which already use aluminum casting. So, how far along is Tesla really? While there's no official confirmation of aluminum in cells being installed in the Model 2 yet, insider leaks and supply chain activity tell a very different story. Tesla is reportedly producing 100 to 200 prototype cells per day between its Cato Road and Fremont facilities. These are not theoretical exercises. They are full-scale production readiness trials. Giga Nevada is allegedly testing them under real-world driving conditions. With performance simulations mimicking both urban stop and go traffic and extended highway usage, the results so far, nothing short of revolutionary. Collaborations with the University of Queensland, a global leader in aluminum mine research, have pushed performance boundaries to stunning levels. Early lab tests show 99% capacity retention after 10,000 charge cycles, a number that crushes lithium's typical 1,000 to 2,000 cycle lifespan. Furthermore, Tesla has addressed aluminum ion's previous Achilles heel, moisture sensitivity. With chemical tweaks like fluethylene carbonate, they've enhanced electrode stability and created a battery chemistry that is not only viable, but production-ready. However, it's not all smooth sailing. The process of scaling up aluminum Battery production echoes the early struggles of Tesla's 4,680 cells, which at one point saw 70 to 80% cathode material loss during trial manufacturing. But just like the 4,680 line, which now pumps out 500,000 cells per day, aluminum ions' growing pains are being actively resolved. Tesla's ability to learn, adapt, and scale where others would fail is their ultimate strategic advantage, and Tesla is placing its bets where it matters. The Model 2 is set to be unveiled in late 2025. With production starting in 2026, analysts predict that aluminum ion battery versions will be introduced in select trims first, with a full rollout by 2027. The most jaw-dropping part, the Model 2 could offer up to 600 miles of range using this battery technology, simultaneously killing range anxiety and price anxiety. Asterisk, but the implications stretch far beyond electric vehicles. The $1,795 aluminum ion battery is more than a component. It's the blueprint for a global energy shift. Tesla could soon decentralize battery production entirely. A 2024 Nature Communications study shows that aluminum ion batteries are ideal for modular, small-scale manufacturing, which opens the door to microfactories across the globe. No longer constrained by massive gigafactory models, Tesla could start producing these batteries locally, anywhere, cutting logistics costs by up to 40%. Imagine cars batteries, and energy systems being built in developing nations, rural areas, or remote regions that current tech simply can't reach. Aluminum batteries also offer unparalleled temperature resilience, operating perfectly from minus 40 degrees Celsius to plus 80 degrees Celsius. That means you can use these batteries in deserts, tundras, or even outer space. Which brings us to the most audacious possibility. Space Tesla's aluminum ion batteries are already being eyed for interplanetary applications. Collaborations with SpaceX suggest that these cells could one day power lunar rovers, satellites, or even Mars-based habitats. A 2024 Science Advances study has confirmed their suitability for space travel, thanks to their lightweight design, temperature stability, and durability. The Model 2 is thus more than a car. It's a test platform for technologies that could power the future of space exploration. Customizability is another game-changer. Aluminum ion technology allows for tailored energy outputs, enabling Tesla to offer battery configurations optimized for urban commuters, long-distance drivers, or fleet operators without changing the cost structure. Imagine walking into a Tesla showroom and choosing your battery, just like you'd pick storage. Options on a smartphone, affordable, powerful, and customized to your lifestyle. But the impact doesn't stop with vehicles. Aluminum ion batteries can transform every Model 2 into a mobile power node, contributing to decentralized microgrids and offering backup energy in disaster zones or rural areas. This is not just a technological upgrade, it's a societal shift asterisk.